season of Jalad Dikla just started with quite a bang as all the three judges grooved on a prestigious dance platform. This time around, stand-up comedian Kapil Sharma monkeys around with Manish Paul on the Jalad Dikla just sixth stage. And for the grand introduction episode, there was Ranveer Kapoor to give some serious competition to these two clowns. While Ranveer Kapoor claimed to be plain bored of doing the towel dance on sundry shows, he got a tad innovative on Jalad Dikhlaja and replaced the towel with a bar of soap that he gave a ludicrous name, the Sabun Dance 2. Even has Shan Kroon, Jab Se Mere Nena, the track from Savaria, that first film that had some contribution in catapulting RK to fame. But apart from silly one-liners and ridiculous jokes, we would love to see the list of highlights of the show. Moments that would want us to make us want to tune into Jalad again and keep a tab on what's happening on that star-studded grooving podium. Madhuri Dixit dancing with Katak maestro Pandit Birju Maharaj left us mesmerized. Remo's tribal dance act acquainting the viewers with all the choreographers was a high-octane performance fierce and fabulous with a raw appeal that made it an energetic hip-hop jungle gig. Drashti Dhami and Salman Yusuf Khan, the eye candy couple, opened the show with their romantic performance waltz. The Madhubala babe needed to be lighter on her feet, remarked the king of technique, Remo D'Souza, who reassured her that when a choreographer like Sal is with her, there's absolutely nothing to fear. The Deols, Dharmendra, Sunny Deol and Bobby Deol made a dhamakedar appearance on the show to promote their new film, Yamla Pagla Divana 2. While Sunny and Maz recreated the Tridev magic by shaking a leg or two on Mehteri Mohammed May, veteran star Dharmendra spiced up the episode by dancing with contestant Shweta Tiwari. Aarti Chabria was all irritating as she kept repeating, I've worked super hard, so what girl, everyone has. But a saucy bachata was enough to overlook off that. And as for Firangi Lauren, as Karan says, she danced like a typical Bollywood heroine despite arriving from the land of milk and honey, the USA. She is without a single trace of doubt a strong contender, but this strong dancer might lose votes because not many know her, expect perhaps as a heroine of Remo's ABCD and a contestant on the American TV show So You Think You Can Dance. But if you have noticed, she's playing her cards quite right. In fact, she started to shuffle and scatter them in the right direction. Gazing in Keicho's direction with her own version of director's Kuch Kuch Hota Hai dialogue, she said that, Hum jalak mein ek hi bar aate hain. Ek bar perform karte hain aur jeette bhi ek hi bar hain. Great way to get noticed, girl. And for God's sake, what is Suresh Menon doing on the show? Is he here to fool around and to be comic element and Shan stop killing us with all that cuteness? Unfortunately, all the charm is working like black magic, more than enough to put us right off. We think the fun and spontaneous element is missing and by fun, we don't mean Manish and couples unhinged stupidity. The contestants should loosen up, stop the I have worked hard thing a hundred times a minute business and everyone needs to get down to some serious rivalry and dancing. We will go with 3 out of 5 for Jalak Diglaja 6.